Roofing. Roofing. All right, welcome back to the SOS podcast. Yeah, because welcome back, welcome once. in. Come on now, we're here. It's we uh, Sunday. We in this it's bitch. I don't even know what the date is today to be honest. The fourteenth. It's, it's Valentine's Day. Day. Holy <laughs> shit! Oh uh, yeah, week nine. nine. Episode like nine. That. Still going strong. Um, strong man. Idea. Yo, how was your week? Hey, um. Quiet, actually, yeah. I fucking barely worked. I got shit done. I had another root canal. Fuck that up. Um, yeah, and a couple of po- or a possible uh, job opportunity. We'll see what happens. Try not get my hopes up about it, but we'll uh, see what uh, what comes of it. And I had a great weekend. Played Friday night yesterday. I chilled. Went to oh, what time? Went to uh, uh, it was like two o'clock. I watched. That was later than no, that. No, it wasn't. But... It was five thirty in the fucking morning. No, can I? I was getting there, and it's not my fault. We were up till five thirty. I wanted to say that again. <clears throat> um, but we went to a new winery outside of Clyde, um, uh, in between Clyde and Bellevue, um, called the Copper Whale. It's a really the cool Copper place. Whale. The Copper Whale. Yeah, it was a really really cool place. Um, you have no idea it's there. The owner was super friendly. He was going around thanking everybody for coming. Wine was good. Wine was cheap. It was a it was a cool place, definitely a place I would go back. So, why was it called the Copper Whale? Was it themed? I like didn't ask. Watery? No, it wasn't. I actually didn't ask. I'm pretty but... sure the logo is a Copper Whale. Oh, mm. that would make sense. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really understand what that big fact was for. I threw that out there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that the, into I'm the pretty scene. sure the logo for the Copper Whale is a Copper Whale. Yeah, yeah, yeah but it's definitely sure. like I would. I, didn't, well, I was talking about was like is inside and... like whale themed or is no, it just called not. the copper whale it's not yeah it's not. it's a rustic it'd be, inside it'd be an interesting theme yeah that would like be like ocean themey ocean 11 um That's it was cool. uh and then last night i hung out with uh sir logan and uh, we had a good time sir logan and sammy sam co it's like paul mccartney that is <laughs> right. sir sammy logan. what i did to deserve sammy, that. and sammy sofa yeah <laughs> sammy sammy sofa. Sofa. <laughs> and then we went to brunch today Yes, so, we did. Went I went to brunch, brunch today, too. I, I, yeah, we all did. Brunch we did a brunch. Valentine's Day brunch. We did a Valentine's Day brunch. Where, I went to ask Happy you, where Valentine's you Day, everybody, for all you lovebirds in here. Was that BG? Paris, we're... Scramblers. Right Scramblers. Right across from Scramblers. Scramblers? Isn't there a Scramblers yeah. Marie, or that used to be a place? That's what I'm mm-hmm. talking about. That's, That's the same thing? Okay. They just dropped the Marie. Yeah. Okay. I'm working anymore. She died. Or she died. So, uh, Goldsby, what are you drinking today? Um, Getting out of the bottom of the box of the wine. Wait... Same box, out. huh? Does it say rabbit, rabbit spaghetti? It does. It says, How many uh, bottles do you fit in that box? It does. Rabbit spaghetti? The like rabbit patootie. <laughs> From it's ratatouille. What? what? You ever seen ratatouille? The yeah, movie? but you said it's rabbit like patootie. Rabbit spaghetti, like... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> yeah, it's called... See, this is this is the point in the, in the conversation. Yeah, I want to know what the fuck he's thinking. Yeah, where, where are you going? <laughs> I feel the I feel the wheels turning. Anyway, so it's called Rabbit Spaghetti. Uh, it's a Shiraz. I don't know. It's all right. Is it good? It's okay. I like. It's that. Definitely not cool. the top. So of that's the last bo- bo- I have one box. Box. One more. And You've I, liked one. Yeah. I mean, I still drink them, but like, yeah. you know, I'm, I'm I'm like, if I would go buy again, it would only be one of them. But so that's the one you had last week. Yeah. That's that's what I was saying. Like, wouldn't you rather spend more mean? money? And get better I quality. Had no, I had no idea what to expect. It was the first time I've ever done okay, this. Okay, but now, now that you know, hands down, absolutely. You'd spend absolutely. a little bit more money. Yeah. So that that good price on Groupon, sure. that good price on wherever else you can you buy these things. I'm just saying, like you, when, wait, no, when Groupon, Groupon has these offers, I haven't for, used Groupon in years. For, but no, I get what you're saying. For like a, uh, you know, Groupon let's get ten okay. bottles for forty bucks, ten bottles for fifty bucks, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Would you? So it's you're saying wine. go ahead and spend the extra money and just I get think the bottles. Go ahead. Go ahead. I think anywhere, we did talk I, about this, but I just want to reminisce. No, 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 no. But it's one. <laughs> are you gonna pour more of that? Or are you just gonna hold the bottle? <laughs> no, 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 no. no. <laughs> I'm waiting. Do you still use Groupon? I haven't in a long time. No, I haven't. But I, I just see that stuff when when I would scroll through Groupon, I'd be like. Okay, wait, man, I really want this, like, fucking 12-pack of wine bottles. It's amazing how many apps you can just, like, scroll through and just not even realize you're scrolling through them. For sure. Like, for sure, yeah. Like, you just, just like, our, like, last week's... Last just week's getting on that mode to pay me, and it's like... I Dude, it's, it's impossible mm-hmm. not to. Then you're like, oh, somebody liked my... Liked what I said when I paid somebody. So, when like, we... Like yeah. dumpster blumpkins. <laughs> <laughs> that'd be... Imp- got four likes. That'd be impressive. More than well, Instagram. Yeah, dumpster, like, can you actually get a dumpster? dumpster? Um, well, first off, you're shitting in the dumpster, so that's gross. I'm in. Um, <laughs> you're so in the dumpster. You're drinking so the Syrahs. We talked about the wine. Yeah, yeah. We talked about the wine yeah, because yeah. I have, 
like ten to twenty dollars is typically my price range. If you're gonna buy a, de- you can buy a decent, a decent, decent bottle of wine for eighteen bucks. So ten to twenty, I'll go maybe twenty five. It's something I'm really wanting. I don't usually go less than ten. Mm. The Cabernet that I drank last night. Was- oh no, 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 it's Sutter Home, and yeah, it's not. It's I think it's Sutter usually, Home's garbage. Yeah, it, it was it's right. cheap. Yeah. So uh, yeah, I mean I'm you know it, I've drank a lot of beer yesterday, so it's good to have a lot of. I mean, it's okay. It's definitely, like I said, the Shiraz is a little more. How did you describe it? A zest- Shiraz. It's a tart. It's a tart can. Tar- yeah, it's a tart can. That was it definitely. Sounds it's, good. It's uh, it's bitey. It's got a nice it's bitterness. Got a little bite to it. Um, I wasn't expecting that. And it's tart. It's very but, tart. So yeah. it's like a fruity it's tart. tart. It's tart. Yes. Yeah. So um, like pop tart. Yeah, that was my week, Jordan. What do you? I see you're holding on to a new bottle. Um. Yeah. Yeah. He yeah, yeah, yeah. I got uh, I got us a bottle of uh, Glen Livet Founders Reserve. It is the American Oak selection. Uh, single malt scotch hmm. and that's what uh, i'm sipping on today and oh, ice cubes lasted you a while it has it has those like big you're fucking not ice balls you're not great. you're pouring like triples every <laughs> time <laughs> he's, not, he's on vacation yeah, i am on vacation you've drank a glass and a half of that well i'm on vacation so that's why cheers to that flowing but, out. no my uh my week was great um speaking of your wine i actually bought a bottle of wine for uh, my upcoming trip but i did i did uh this Where weekend I'll get to that. Okay, this sorry. weekend, I went uh, uh, went and hung out with my brother and had a good time. Got to listen to some live music for the first time in a very long time, so that was cool. That was that was something I've been wanting to do for a long time. COVID and everything fucked all that up for live music, so got to see uh, you know just a guy playing acoustic guitar and singing. It was great, um, and a girl. See that at Logan's too, as well. Um, but yesterday went snowboarding in Ohio. Had its ups and downs. Literally probably like, it's a lot like the elevator business yes or the snowboarding business lifts anyway um okay. it was fun it was fun it was a good time they had a good terrain park it was cool um but it is ohio and it would feel it it was like 20 minute lines I could just for feel, I could 10 second runs so coming from him trying to figure out what he's yeah saying. it was how it was, it was, rough. it was rough it was rough so uh, you are on vacation this coming week yes full time yes i mean i'm on vacation all week this is my first Mode. day off of vacation kind of kind of just be careful on i-80 when you go to kentucky yeah yes. i gotta be careful <laughs> thanks, thanks hello jordan it's your mom <laughs> i love her um what if she what, what would be even funnier is if she titled every text that's how it started every single text no matter if you guys were like she, you texted back and you then don't she understand texted that you is every so text. she texted you back you want to look at my hey, phone hey this is your okay phone. no okay. Okay. every <laughs> initial text okay. every single hey, initial jordan, text it's your mom. hey jordan it's your mom i think you, you initially that. text her that every time i'm going to when you text her I'm from now to. on every time she calls me now she talks about the squirrels in the backyard because of that commercial the state farm commercial no the the state farm commercial when they're when they're talking about when he's like on the on the helicopter pad fighting off people and shit, and then his mom calls oh, him. Oh yes. Hey son, yeah. it's your mom. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. That's this is what all it's this like I'm a little busy. From. So now it's just like an ongoing joke, inside joke, oh, but it's just kind of reality I thought it was now. Because the squirrels <laughs> missed you talking to them. Probably because I used to talk to squirrels. Anyway, I'm on vacation and I tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow I'm leaving bright and early during a snow and ice storm, crossing the entire country and driving what? five and a half hours to. The, ma- the storm that is hitting massive. Is I thought you, I thought you said you were, you were driving the all the way across the country like five hours. hours. No, I'm <laughs> driving five and a half hours to go to Campton, Kentucky, because it's the closest place that you can stay currently stay in a treehouse, and it's a geodesic. That's a lot different than a tree, by the it's way. It's a it's a so geodesic that's dome. The text that I got. I set him up. It's the closest place I can sleep in a tree. Is what I said. You can sleep in a tree what in my backyard. You think? Yes, not when it's. 25 degrees. Oh, you could. Though. I could, but I'm. It's gonna be. It's it's Actually, in a I'm dome, a geodesic dome in a tree, in a tree and I was like, fuck yeah, I'm doing it. So I just booked it, and I'm gonna you drive there yourself? and do it. Yeah, I'm going by myself. Getting um, some dome in a tree. And I wish some dome in a dome that tree. was the case. <laughs> I'm sleeping in a dome. Um, Let's get. Never mind. Um, <laughs> not, invite yes. your friend. Yes. Um. Anyway, I. Anywho. Yeah, I'm gonna be uh hiking Red River Gorge. So I'm gonna do some winter hiking, wow, at me. and then I'm also you were the one talking to me, and I'm also there's a couple of indoor uh, uh, bouldering gyms, so I'm gonna do a little bit of rock climbing while I'm there as well. All right, so so what's that? What's bouldering? rock climbing? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> did you say what is rock climbing? 
Bouldering is a form of rock climbing where you're not harnessed in, and yeah. it's usually no more than like 12 to 14 feet high. So, but this is indoor, you said? Yeah, it's okay. an indoor gym. That's There's cool. a couple indoor gyms around there, so I'm gonna well, I'm gonna check that out. It's kind of like Toledo off, or something. But, that'd be cool. Yeah, that's Genoa. gonna be that's gonna be part of my uh, nonprofit and bike rack that I put together. It's gonna be a badass uh, rock climbing gym too. It's gonna happen. <clears throat> Stay tuned. Not yeah, anytime soon, but I'm gonna do it. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it eventually. It's gonna happen. I want to. Gage. Oh yeah, I forgot Jordan. I said I was drinking. Um, I'm drinking the same shit that Jordan's drinking. One love it. <clears throat> and my week has been all over the place. Work was normal, I guess. I don't think anything crazy went at work today this week. Do you ever have to cover bitty wrestling? Fuck no. Okay, I no. wondered because like I've seen like bitty <clears throat> wrestling tournaments and oh, shit, there's a wrestling and tournament it's on Wednesday. Crazy. So and then Clay's I'm, girls won their second game. I'm two two and zero oh when covering them. So. Nice. They played so good luck, Scott, is what and they were fucking bad. Not as bad as Rossford, but I think the Scott team would have beat Rossford by like six. Really? I have a question for you. How is how is things now, like, uh, progressively with, with COVID and your job and the schools? Like, how are things school, going well, school wise, it's in general? It's ridiculous because <clears throat> shit will get canceled and rescheduled, like... The same day so like it's it's kind of a hodgepodge mess oh yeah and if you have an ad that's not on top of shit it's even worse um a lot of stuff that happens isn't even in even in, even even like isn't even scheduled so like there's nobody that knows about it because it's not scheduled <clears throat> and then but they'll just be like team show up to play and i'll be like who the fuck is playing today there's nothing in any <laughs> of the three systems that we use to tell me there's a game they're like, oh, yeah, I just scheduled it this morning. Well, thanks. I should probably be in that email. But it kind of works. It's kind of it working. It works. It, it, would work. just, it works everywhere else. It's just inconvenient. Yeah, because, for sure. It's inconvenient for and all like, parties, really. Actually, like, athletic training-wise, it's not really. I mean, it kind of made shit easier because I basically game, was able to come up with, like, protocols and stuff. That's like, normally we just tape whatever, but now it's like, if, it's not, if I don't deem it medically necessary or, like, you're not actively rehabbing it or actively doing something to make it better you're not getting taped for a game because if you can go in practice without it and you can not want it to be better then you don't need it to be taped in theory so it's saved clay a bunch of money for me not having to buy a bunch of shit but other than that it's no no really different besides wearing a mask and fucking goggles and shit to wear goggles to wear some sort of eye protection i just wear fucking clear, safety glasses, clear safety glasses. Yeah, yeah. Where at? Hmm. Like where you have to wear goggles at? Anytime you see an athlete. Really? It's a mercy protocol. Huh. I mean, just our our trainer doesn't, and she wears a mask, and that's it. So that's why yeah, I'm like shocked to hear that. It's, 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 it's through Prometica. It's through. It's like yeah, it's it's not through Prometica. Prometica doesn't have an athletic training program. What did you used to work for? Gnomes. Oh, I thought it was Prometica. They're through Total Rehab, probably is what gives works sir. That's whatever's uptown. I just know the lady that covers ours covers like Old Fort and St. Joe yeah. covers a whole slew in the area. But yeah, she doesn't that would wear goggles. That would fucking suck, by the way, to cover four schools. Three or four schools. That'd be miserable. I mean, I know it's probably just games, but. it's I think it's a little bit different, too, when if you don't have like, like Old Fort doesn't have football. So, you know, you don't have to worry about that. You don't have to worry about that, like them and the volleyball and the, you know, so. I don't, but I think she only like, there's like three of them that cover all the area schools. Yeah, yeah. Which and they is... just kind of float between. I mean, you're you're in a good situation with where you're at because you just can can consistently have that. But uh, other than that, how was your week? Good week. It was all right. Decent. Busy. All right. And you got some painting. Busy. Yeah, I painted a shit ton of stuff. Hell yeah! Studio is coming together. I couldn't sit. Studio is coming together. I think it'll look a lot better when it's not just a big ass solid gray wall. I know. There's some shit on it. What's uh? You get the painting done. Are you? What's the the next step in the house? That's a good fucking clean the basement up probably. Mm. Get your, get your gym going. Shit. Get your uh, golf. I have simulator. to actually measure how. High we put a golf simulator down there. I'm gonna measure how high the fucking. Hmm. No, I never said that. But oh. probably, I probably. I was starting to say that. I knew you were. That's yeah. why I finished. I was like, time out. Um, Thank you for finishing my sentence. Probably not like a, if I do. Probably Always finish. Full simulator. Twelve seconds. Um, Logan, how was your week? It was good. <laughs> That's it. It was good. That was good. It's a pretty normal week. You're uh, still laid off, huh? Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Don't mind. 
Not a bad thing. Well, yeah. Could be worse. It could always be worse. Absolutely could always be worse. Yeah, no, I don't, I'm kind of treating it like You could have to get up early, 3.45, go to work. Yeah, I don't miss that at all. I don't even, I go, that's the time I usually go to bed, probably. You go to bed at 3.40? In, in between 2 and two and 3.30. I only do that when Goldsby comes over to my... I do that, I do that <laughs> like every day. Uh, I get up at 7, 8 o'clock. Yeah, it was normal. I feel like I ate a lot of fucking food this week. A lot of money. Oh, some good food though. Besides that, we all went to brunch. What did you have at brunch? You're loaded, loaded tots. Loaded tots. Mike, what did you have at brunch? Real, real quick. Where no, did you... this is real quick. This is what we're real quicking. So Friday night we went to, we went and got sushi at Tea Tree. That's what I was gonna ask. Where you guys went Friday? Tea Tree's really, really good. Yeah, we like Tea Tree. I think Tea Tree Bistro, Wednesday or Thursday, one of them's half off. Thursday's half off. Tuesday too. Tuesday is it? Tuesday and Thursday. Yeah. Um, yeah, we Saturday. went and got sushi Friday. Saturday we got went to some Mexican joint by Swanton. Actually had a margarita that I liked. Is that the new El Camino? Yeah, right there across from the golf course. Yeah, yeah, on yeah. airport. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's the new, brand new one. They just put it in, yeah. dude. The fucking pretty good. I got it was like grilled. No, it's uh holiday something. Uh, I don't remember what it is. Holiday I, I pass it all the time. Like My brother lives right down the road from it. He lives on Conrad too, or Conrad really? D. Yeah, he lives right. right yeah, we were gonna right go bowling, there. but uh, there was like some elementary school. We got yelled at by a lady when we walked in because we weren't there for the elementary school, and we had to go to that place. But I got like a grilled grilled chicken with like chorizo. 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 Yeah, that's a little better. Yeah, it was really good. Um, and then yeah, brunch today. Nice. Rome. All right, so you got loaded tots. What'd you get? Loaded tots. Loaded tots for Mike. Good? What'd you get? I got the uh, avocado toast. No, I didn't this time. I got uh, the sweet potato hash. It was fire. Really good. What'd you I get? Had a today? Baja burrito. Baja burrito, huh? Yeah, that's pretty good. That's jalapenos, eggs, some like mango y salsa, and chorizo, and I think that was it. <laughs> say that again. Chorizo. I'm going to say it like. Chorizo. Oh, a white person. <laughs> almost sounds like a D. Chorizo. Chorizo. Sounds like a what? The double R's almost sounds like a D. It's like chorizo. Chorizo. All right, here we go. <laughs> the facial expression he's making while saying that he's so makes me serious. Mad. He is. He I'm is. trying as hard as I can. I'm fucking this all up, but I'm trying. All right. Well, it sounds like we all had a uh, somewhat productive, somewhat normal, somewhat crazy <laughs> week. Everybody was a little kind of all over the place. I'm looking forward to hearing your adventures this week because you go to Kentucky and then coming back and seeing where you go from there, and then you're going to Pennsylvania next weekend. So Jordan is a. Uh, all over the place. And, and of course, the week that you're doing this is when we're just supposed to get pounded with snow the whole Midwest. Yeah, yeah. Tomorrow, oh, I'm good right now. Tomorrow morning is going to be Jordan, awful. There, well, there's a second, there's a second snowstorm coming on Thursday. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, actually, I'm I'm actually really excited about the second one because well, it's yeah. going to put Wait, this snowstorm. It's going to put five inches same, of fresh powder on the slopes yeah. for the same time. Yeah, he's going to sleep in a tree. Yes. Yeah, I'm going to be like iced in. This little like there'd be snowed in a tree. I got a dope ass bottle of wine. You were talking about wine earlier. You said that uh, your go-to is ten to twenty dollar bottles. Is yeah. like your that's what I'm gonna get when I get a bottle of wine to drink with myself or share with friends, whatever. That's your normal go-to, correct? Mm -hmm. Ten to twenty dollars. Mine is like ten to fifteen. That's what I usually get if I'm gonna have one at home or mm -hmm. if I usually when I cook Italian food, I'll get a bottle of wine. Um, but on special occasions, who go for the, the, the six? Go for the top shelf, you know, like at Kroger, you got your three shelves or four shelves, whatever. But I'll go, I'll look at the top shelf on special occasions, and I found a cool ass bottle. And the only reason I got it is because of the logo, and that's what I'm gonna drink when I'm in this like tree house, this uh, dome house thing. Nice. How much was it? It was thirty five bucks, which I feel like isn't no, terrible. Sounds like a normal bottle, but it's not what I would usually <laughs> buy. So. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go all out this time. That'll keep you warm. Yeah, it'll keep me. It'll keep me warm in this ice storm. But I do oh, plan on hiking the Red River Gorge. Um, so I'm super stoked about that. How long are you there? Uh, three days, and then I come home, 
and then I leave straight for Pennsylvania. So I'm going down to Kentucky, coming back, and then leaving straight for Pennsylvania. All in a fucking winter storm. Taking I eighty the whole time. Yeah, I eighty <laughs> to seventy five. I I eighty all the way to uh, Kentucky. Fucking, Jesus, yeah. No. Hello, Jordan. It's your mom. <laughs> so this week, I um, with me being home a little bit more, and I had a little bit of downtime. I got caught up on some shows. I watched a little more TV, and you know, one of the movies that I watched was The Bucket List. Great movie, by the way, Morgan Freeman. I don't know if I've ever seen it all the way through. Excellent movie. Yeah. Excellent movie. Great movie. Have you seen Logan? Yeah. And a song called Bucket List by Mitchell Tenpenny is also a very good song. Add to that. Go ahead. Carry I don't on. know if I've seen that. Fan of him. I don't know if I've heard of You don't of like Mitchell Tenpenny? I'm not a fan of like new age country music, but I do enjoy Mitchell Tenpenny's songs. Oh, you songs. played that today? Yeah, yeah, Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to sing that like, I'll call you later? No, I don't. I don't know if he does or not, but That's he does like sing. The song I've ever no, heard he before. sings. Uh, he sings. Uh, Maybe drunk me. me. Drunk me. Drunk me can't get over you. That song. I'm not. I'm not big into country music. I'm not, I'm not hating on the fact you like him. That's fine. No, 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 no. I'm just saying. I I, 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 I think he sings that song. And like the first time I heard that song, I like, cringed. I've never heard that song. The only songs I know by him are Drunk Me and um. I randomly heard. Uh, bucket list by him not too long ago, and I was like, "Wow, this is actually a really good song." Mitchell with Tenpenny, yeah. But anyway, go ahead, carry on. So with the uh, bucket list, um, got me wondering. Like I started thinking to myself, like certain things that I wanted to accomplish. And the problem is, and like some people would like, wait, are like wait, 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 a bucket list can't be something that you accomplish. Yes, it is. Yes, it, it is. is. But I'm saying, like, do. that sounded more or less like a like something that so you, you want to do as a career no. or something like that. No. So uh, accomplish in life. Okay. 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 All right, all right, all right. All right, all right go ahead. I'm reaching. Go ahead. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> the, premise, the whole premise to a bucket list means before you kick the bucket, it means aka before you are dead, and it's something yeah, that, that you want we to know do. This. Now, some people sure? are like, why would I, I, I want to have a bucket? Why would I want to have a bucket list when I'm in my 20s? You know, it's just weird. Like, I just want to accomplish this shit. It doesn't have to be a bucket list. And some people don't even think about this. Other people think about like oh i want to do this i want to do this i, wanna, I you know i would love to do this one day and they kind of create a bucket list and so it got me wondering if any of my other friends have some type of bucket list or something that you would consider something similar of that style i really want to free fall do you, no. does anybody have an actual that should, bucket probably, list? That should probably be the last thing you do <laughs> no, it's not how I want to go out. I John Mayer, know. Tom Petty. Yeah. Um, does anybody actually have a like, legitimate like a list? list? Like a list, down? like no. like no. not necessarily a list no. written down, but like a mental list, no. like it says, "Hey, I, I want to do this, this, and this." I have made. Before there's I a thing in my in, yeah. in my notes. I have a thing of like a places that I've seen or come across. I'm like, oh, that'd be really cool to go to. But it, there's nothing like I don't have an actual list of like. I've wrote down like in my mind. I know like I want to skydive, things. you know, and do certain yeah, things like mind. that. Okay. But right. it's not at the same time, you know. Now the free falling thing is interesting to me because I don't feel like there's many people that want to free fall because free falling be, like the most exhilarating thing. No, absolutely in the world. nothing attached. How does that work? Like, what do you? They come down after you, but you jump out of a plane without a parachute. Jesus Christ! Yeah, yeah. and yeah. that's crazy. <laughs> you don't have to die. You have sex and then you How die. How do you do this? You have a choice. So you sign a waiver. You can jump out of a plane and die. No, I don't think free fall. There's like nothing there. You just fall. So and then uh, they dive, dive down and catch you essentially. Hopefully. I think See, that's the thing. Yeah. Oof. Free falling? No, it is. Yeah. It is. Now that you say that I I understand. Because there's multiple different types. Like there's like bungee jumping, but you are the ones that like jump off of cliffs, but then they have like the like a parachute thing like they like like fly down squirrels. like a wing. Yeah. yeah. Like that type of deal. Become a flying squirrel. <laughs> <laughs> so See, Jordan See, is I mean, I'm just fire. curious what you guys have. If there's something that like in your mind that you're like, I want to do this one day. Like, yes, absolutely. I can't fucking wait. That's I'm going to accomplish that. Um most of my things are like places I want to go and experience. Um, and a lot of other things are like physical accomplishments that I want to do. But mainly like I like one thing that really sticks out when you said bucket list is I want to go to Norway and I want to experience. <laughs> Fuck you, Norway. <laughs> Fuck you, Norway. <laughs> No, really. I want to go somewhere in that, that region, and I want to. Ex- 
You motherfuckers. Oh, I forgot reason, reason. Let me say it. Like, God reason. damn it, Will <laughs> Ferrell, you motherfucker! <laughs> the reason we're laughing is because Will, Will Ferrell, Ferrell had a commercial on the Super Bowl, and just Google that, and you'll understand. But the Norway, the Norway is fucking hilarious, because we were just talking about that tonight. And then you're like, I want to go to Norway. Didn't even think of it. I wouldn't even brought it up. Didn't even think of it. <laughs> he punches the dog. globe. <laughs> Fuck you, Norway. <laughs> anyway, I want to go to Norway because I want to experience the Northern Lights for real. Mm. I want to. I want to literally be in a cabin or a geodesic dome, like I'm about to stay in Kentucky. I want to be there in Norway and experience the Northern Lights, um, and maybe even snowboard there because I hear they got some pretty dope ass uh, slopes there, but. Um, stuff like that is more on my list, but, um, yeah, definitely, definitely some different travel destinations. I don't right. think I've ever noticed how much you talk with your hands until this episode. Cause you keep fucking hitting me like, probably because you moved closer to me. Yeah. I was trying to make the camera. We're all happen. gathering a little closer because we became closer as, COVID. We, as episodes progress. We're, we're, we're just getting we're better as friends. No, nah. no. All right. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I really don't like you guys. Gage. <laughs> what about your bucket list? What's on your bucket list? I don't really. I mean, I have some things that I would like to do, but like, I don't know if it's. Can you give examples? Yeah. Can you give me a second? Yeah, that's like what. I, I don't know if it would I'm consider not, like I'm... bucket list because like it's. I I would say like bucket list is something that's not easily easily obtainable, all the time. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like. Some I mean, of the stuff is not like eventually. there's there's some golf courses I want to play, but like I could literally do that right now. Right. There's not, not like specific, a monumental yeah, thing. Yeah, it's not like, a monumental climb thing. Climbing fucking Mount Everest really or something like that. Like that. You know what right. I mean? Yeah, like, for you sure. You can do that whenever you want, technically. So I don't know if it's technically like there's a couple places I want to go play golf. There's a couple places I want to visit, but like, is that a bucket list? Would be the real question. I, don't I, mean, know. I think it's all depending on personal preference. Yeah, I mean, I guess even opinion. if it's a place that you could go tomorrow, like, are you gonna go tomorrow? Probably but, not. But I, but I mean, I guess maybe but it could be on your bucket list. But but it, what what is something that maybe you wouldn't be able to achieve tomorrow that you might be able to achieve in ten years that you're like, you know what, this is what I want to do, and this is what I've been thinking about Make for sure a very long time. Doing. Like, I want this to happen I in really my life at some point. Okay, that's one. There you go. Japan would be fucking dope. Boom. Lost in Japan. Like sushi in Japan. Like. Tiesto and and uh, DJ Tiesto. Yeah, DJ Tiesto and and uh, what's his name? I don't know. You fucking brought it up. Yeah. <laughs> post, post Malone. Post Malone. <laughs> you gonna finish my thought or what? Getting sushi in Japan. But we yeah, can. that something like that. Some maybe some like extensive list of travel destinations would be my yeah. bucket list. I don't have anything like crazy, like crazy, crazy. But, yeah, like, out of airplanes. I mean, it, it is it is different when I mean, that shit would be cool, but like, nah. Like two midgets shitting into a bucket. Why would that be a bucket list? Is that a Cards Against Humanity card? Is. <laughs> I fucking hate you. Jordan is a walking Cards Against Humanity uh, card. Like I just I feel that's like a very a good fucking point. That's like the greatest analogy to Jordan I've ever heard. That should you be that should be a walking Tinder, Tinder bio. Cards Against Humanity's game. You're just the whole game. No, I'm gonna be single for the rest of my life. So, for me, and it's it is interesting now that I think about it because we're at the age that we are. Like we have several years to accomplish some of these things. But then I think that's why people also get bucket lists is because they think they oh well I've got plenty of time I got plenty of time but and then you look up and you're 85. In reality, how much time do we really have? None of us really know. So that's why I if there's something that I want to do, I I figure out the way I want to do it and just get it fucking done and just do it. Because I don't want to get to the point in my life where maybe can't I can't it. do it. Yeah. You know, if something physical happens to me and I can't, you know, go to New York City and go to the top of the whatever, you know. Mount Everest. That's exactly, City, but. <laughs> that's exactly why I decided, like, I literally booked the trip that I'm going on tomorrow two days ago. Mm -hmm. And I was sitting in the car and I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Life's way too short. I mean, I got I got the funds. I can do whatever I want to do. I have nothing holding me back. Why would I not go on this trip? I I literally was like, you know what? I want to I want to stay in a treehouse somewhere. Where can I go? I'm gonna look for the local the the closest place that I can sleep in a tree. And that's why I texted you that. <laughs> um, but I, I, I want to sleep in a tree for three nights, and that's what I'm gonna do. And I found the closest place, and it happened to be Campton, Kentucky. 
and that's where I'm gonna go. It's a five and a half hour drive. Fuck it, I'm gonna go. And yeah. it happens to be a geodesic dome. I mean, sure. fucking, it couldn't could be any cooler. And I was like, and for for a while, I was thinking, oh, this vacation, I'm just gonna chill. I'm just gonna be a staycation. I'm not gonna do much. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna work around the house. Yeah. Fuck that. That's way too fucking short. Yeah. Bucket list. Fuck it. Let's go. And, and I get to see the Red River Gorge. Do things that you're gonna have fun doing. I mean, that's all it comes yeah. down to. And yeah, Absolutely. you get to see someplace cool. And I mean, that's how I feel about like. You know, one of the, I know it's not going to happen. Every anytime. time I look up, Logan's looking at himself on my computer monitor. <laughs> <laughs> See if I'm still there because I can just back. <laughs> Lost my train of thought there. Thanks. I apologize. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. Like I said, it was something that just when I watched that movie, I'm like, so like bucket don't list. Run a marathon is that that could be on a bucket absolutely. List. absolutely that is definitely yeah. on a bucket list. Just like just like I want to ride the the coast to coast ride the 222 mile ride. That's like that's something shit. that's bucket list shit. Like I want totally. Oh yeah, absolutely. On free fall, I want to run a marathon and I want to write an album. I feel like you could run a run a marathon now. I like you, I I drive home that's, from work and you're comparing. running. You're just running like goddamn Forrest Gump. Like, it's <laughs> fucking dope, dude. I'm like, dude, I want to be you. Like, I don't even want to ride my fat bike right now. And that is, like, specifically designed for snow. And you're like, it's like 10 degrees out. And you're like, ooh, 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 running I through the fucking the trail. You're like, are you running at White Star? <laughs> yeah, like, dude. Yeah, you following me? Like, hell yeah, it's so dope. <laughs> You just see Logan's big ass running through White Star in the woods. <laughs> Dude, my dad, oh my god, I spotted well, a grizzly. My dad, my dad followed me one day. So I was running through town. I was almost home. Did you in the tractor? <laughs> no. Why would he be in the middle of town? Like he, he pulled up behind me. He's like, oh, you know what? I just I saw this big guy running, and I was like, I wonder who that is. So I just followed him. <laughs> it was weird. Ass I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, oh, that guy's huge running. I wonder who that is. I'm going to go see. I'm going to get it's my son. Oh, that's a big bitch. <laughs> no, that's awesome. Yeah, that's that's the same thing, though. Like, I I would, there's some like physical accomplishments I'd like to achieve just like that, like run a marathon. That's fucking, that's a cool ass accomplishment. And, but a lot of it is like traveling. A lot of it is like physical accomplishments. But other than that, I don't really have too much on my bucket list other than just live life to the absolute fullest. That's it. Just everything, any possibility, any anything that comes my way, I want to be able to say, yeah, I can fucking do that. And if I want to do it, I'm going to fucking do it. Yeah, I definitely think a bucket Simple list is something that. that's for somebody that's older mm -hmm. in a sense. It's like, or, I mean. I mean like you have stage four cancer, you're about to die. Okay, I got seven things that I'm about to do before I die. Yeah. Like, that's something that, but it doesn't have to be. It can be it some, doesn't. it can be the things that you want to do from when you're fucking 18 to when you're. But it's just to put it into breach. It's it's to put it into perspective of the idea of, hey, I should I, I start doing do it things. now. Correct. Do it now. Don't Correct. wait until you're fucking dead. Correct. Don't wait till you yeah, have fucking stage four cancer because you eat but ultra processed foods. And you're not a fucking vegetarian. Because people say like, there's a there's what? a. <laughs> are, you, are you are you like? I, I just threw some shameless. shade. I just threw a little shade. There's a uh, was that, that directed at me? I don't know. He just no, it wasn't. It was directed at the beautiful new wall. That's the sad I wall. I don't know. I don't know what yeah. just happened. Life hands you a Jeffrey. So my I thing think. is like in that. What? <laughs> 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 Who's Jeffrey? Dahmer? Epstein? Whoa. Uh, um, this escalated quickly. I was talking about a. <laughs> yeah. Now we're talking about Jeffrey Dahmer. I don't want to smoke Jeffrey Dahmer. I don't want to smoke Epstein either. He said Epstein. The FBI is knocking on the front. He probably wants to smoke me. I wanted to smoke. A, he doesn't want to smoke you. Jeffrey, which if just do your research, if you if life hands you a Jeffrey, stroke the furry wall. Okay, you just type that into Google. You figure okay. out. No, I, that sounds like something that you read on like, a, like anyway. a bathroom it's not bar. Not going to come with fucking chickens. It's going to come with uh, something. Uh, uh, might be interesting. Anything there. you tell me to Google right. is not going into my Google. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Carry on, Goldsby. No, I we you know like I said, it was just something that I thought about, and I think it was something that we all. Uh, it's good. It's good a perspective. Oh, the last thought I had on that was there is a give and take because some people are like, I have to save up. I can't do anything. I can't go anywhere because I have to get my money and I have to get my finances straight and I have to save up and I have to be able to do other things that I want to do as an adult and not go anywhere because that stuff costs, costs money. And so, but there has to be a good balance between saving up, moving forward in your life that you want to move forward, but then also being able to go on those little trips and doing trips like that to where you're having experiences. Cause I do know people that are like, we don't go anywhere. We don't travel we don't do anything. Cause all I'm doing is trying to save up money and that's it. For sure. And then I'm like, you know, 
then there's me. Fuck it rules the world, man. Well, well it, it does. does. It does. Absolutely. And so it just depends. Some people, like I said, are all into it. And some people will travel and go places. And, you know, you're all over the fucking place the last few years until COVID. You know, I've been all over the place. And so, oh, but the, you have to, there was, I could, I could have saved up. I think about it now. I fuck. I could have saved up thousands of dollars and not gone on the trips that I've gone on. And you're probably in the same boat. You think Absolutely. about it. All the trips that Absolutely. you've been on could have just saved all of that money. But is that extra thousand, two thousand, three thousand dollars worth that you'd have in your savings now worth missing out on the experience that you got then? Not a fucking chance because no, money's just goddamn paper. Yeah. And time and you're, is you're worth so much to make more to me than that. Yeah. Another thing though, um, when it comes to like experiences and things like that, when you when hmm. you good no i don't remember what i was gonna say you had it you had it i did i had a really good one too all right and you can totally see it on the camera uh, it's, it's cereal soup oh. all right <laughs> shit are we recording right now <laughs> oh boy is, is first i got a question for you it smells like mayonnaise you're disgusting is cereal soup is cereal soup fuck no it's not like soup breakfast Why? soup what constitutes because. a soup? What's what's your definition of a soup? Broth. Savory. <laughs> <laughs> That's your only criteria for soup? Soup is no, this is legitimate. Soup is savory. What's cereal? Have you ever had a sweet soup? A a soup that is fucking like cinnamon rolls in a soup. No, you haven't. That's cereal. Cereal is not savory. Yeah, not was... one single soup is or not one single cereal what is savory. What is the definition? Of soup. He's a, li- a liquid dish typically made by boiling meat, fish, or vegetables okay, in so stock yeah, so or yeah, water. It's not. A so. substance or mixture perceived to resemble soup in appearance or consistency. That's a good definition for soup. It is, well, okay. which means that cereal is not. So that's like a question like, is a hot dog a sandwich? Mm. Not the same thing. Yeah. Is a hot dog a sandwich? What's, what oh, is the no. definition of a sandwich? Me between two buns. Um, why, okay. why, why couldn't you say that with a straight face, Gage? I'm not the one that laughed. <laughs> say, why couldn't you hear it without laughing? <laughs> but Gage, how like, many I sandwiches are made that aren't eaten every year? <laughs> why are you looking at me I'm like that? <laughs> <laughs> every time like, you... I'm the one that's making them, throwing them away. <laughs> You've thrown away so many sandwiches. <laughs> all right, all right. What's the what's the sexiest and least sexiest name you can think of? Oh, oh shit. Logan's crying. <laughs> I just he just accused me of something. <laughs> I feel attacked. Okay, I'll go first. Sexy name. Jessica. That's a sexy <laughs> Yeah, buddy. That's uh, sexy or least sexy. Sexiest. 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 What you say, yep. <laughs> least sexiest would be Bertha. Wait, so okay, wait, that was just like, like legit. You think that like Jessica is the sexiest name? Yeah, it is a sexy Fuck name. Fuck yeah, it is. What do you think it is? Jessica Jones. <laughs> <laughs> what about least sexiest? Hmm. Uh-uh, I don't know. There's gotta be a name like, wow, that's a turn off. Like, who named you? <laughs> Why did your parents hate you? <laughs> uh. If you say Michael, so help me God. So, so help me. Um, fuck, I don't know. Hello, I am Matilda. Okay, Jordan, go cool sexiest. Name. Helga? Helga's a good one. Helga. Okay, there we go. <laughs> All right, sexiest name. I right, any Helga. Um, change your name. <laughs> I'll have to say. Jordan doesn't sit up because he's getting hard thinking about it. <laughs> No, um, I think, the uh, I think Sarah is the sexy the pattern that pleads. Very bland. <laughs> I don't know why I said Sarah, but anyway, um, <laughs> first name. No one there. made you. Like, no. you could change your mind right no, now. No, I can't think of anything. That's the first thing that popped in my head. There's not a name um, that you hear, like, wow, that's a sexy name. It could even be like an Italian or some type of foreign no, name. No, trust me. It's definitely going to be, it's, it's going to be foreign. Definitely yeah. going to be foreign. And it's not going to be an American name like Sarah. But. <laughs> I'm gonna think of the most common name yeah, ever. Exactly. Well, um, and what about least sexiest? You're like, wow, I'm inverted. Gertrude. Gertrude. <laughs> Gertie. I feel like all these women live in the same country. <laughs> hey, they're all from the same place. They're big women. Russian. Yeah. They have more hair than I do. 
Gage. Sexiest. Sexiest is going to have to be Brianna. You fucking pussies. And least sexiest, I was going to say Helga, so. Um, no. Yes, that, that's, that's, yeah, that's a state draft. Not, this ain't a top five. This is <laughs> what I think is the least sexiest name. That would have been a good I think draft. if I try to think of a sexy name, I'm just like thinking of a woman that's sexy in the Figure out what her name is. Like, <laughs> not necessarily the Dude, name. Very right? true. Very true. If, all right. If peanut butter wasn't called peanut butter, what would it be called? Nut butter. <laughs> just <laughs> you know, same pee. thing. You just took off There's pee. still a nut in it, and it's considered a butter. If so. there was a nut in it, it'd be called penis butter. <laughs> what? Penis <laughs> butter. <laughs> so you say nut butter? Next. Nut butter. I mean, I guess Ooh, we, I I guess we can just delete those, three letters from the word and it's something else. <laughs> right. Yeah. What do you think, Jordan? I'm interested. Nut butter. Um, Jelly time. Pea cream. Pea cream? Pea cream. All right, we're going to the next one. <laughs> <laughs> what sport would it be the funniest to add a mandatory amount of alcohol to? Ooh. Sumo Football. wrestling. Football. <laughs> 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 Drunk uh, football would be hilarious to watch. Sumo wrestling would be, bro. It'd be the same, just more wobbles. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Some sort okay. of wrestling would have to. It'd have to be wrestling. Drunken, drunken sports. Um, Sumo wrestling. NASCAR. <laughs> <laughs> you know, no. That'd be interesting. Y'all, none of them can drive straight. You have to go 100. And... None, none of them drive straight anyway. It's always left turns, but. I was really disappointed when the Daytona 500 got delayed today. Yeah. Next. What two totally normal things become really weird if you do them back to back? Shit, then come. <laughs> that is kind of weird that you do Wait, that. Two normal it, things. It, it, George's it, like, that's not weird. I do it every day. <laughs> Three other. We okay. T- say that one. Two more. normal things that if you do them back to back are weird. Damn. Damn, the spot. That's kind of what this is about. Look. Um, I don't know. I feel like that's something you actually got to think about. Two normal things that you do. Do them back to back. It's a little fucking weird. Gage? Um, fuck. I'll go. Go. Poop, then eat. Man, that's kind of weird. Like, you're talking like you just go straight from the toilet to, like, eating your food? Do you wash your hands? Yes. Okay. You ever, like, go to a restaurant and have to shit? Take a shit and then you come back and eat your food? Yeah. yeah. No, like you just have to shit food. after. But... I, I don't think... I don't think I've done that. You don't think, you've never took I've a shit, shit at a restaurant? I've shit in an alley. I've pissed in You've never of shit bar. in a restaurant? I've ne- I don't... I don't think I've ever... Before I got my food. He's saying, saying before you got the food. It's you had to poop during your you're like you're eating and you were just like let me go poop. Poo. Is that poo? Is it poo? <laughs> I don't think I poop. Stop saying poo. <laughs> <laughs> meal. What? <I> don't know. <laughs> meal. <laughs> Here we go. This is a good one for Jordan. Fuck. What is the creepiest thing you could say while passing a stranger on the street? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> How's your mom? <laughs> I just know that you're actually gonna do it, and it's gonna be really fucking creepy. Yep. <laughs> I've been waiting. Logan, what do you have? How's your kids? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm not good at this shit. Johnny on the spot. I know. That. Hey, did you need to answer? Creepiest shit when. You see a stranger. Yeah, you're walking down the street of Genoa and you see somebody you've never seen before. No idea who they are and you pass them. What do you say? So like completely creep them out? Yeah. Your bed's comfortable. (laughs) (laughs) Good one. That's good. That's good. (laughs) Good that something Gage has actually said. Like, hey, your bed's comfy. Yeah, a couple times. (laughs) Logan? I don't have anything. Next. What are some things that are it's okay to do okay, occasionally, but definitely not okay to do it every day? Stay up till five thirty in the morning. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna say that 
I'm never doing that again. Until next weekend. Shit in a cup on a road trip. No, <laughs> that's probably it's not something you want. Definitely, Definitely think you actually did that. That's a good one, though. Mm. Shit on the side <laughs> of the road. <laughs> you did do that. No. I did that. You did? Oh, sir. <laughs> I don't have any ice cream. <laughs> what? All right, here we go. So here's what we're going to do. First, everyone needs to think of a product. Uh, okay. So say it all up. Paper towels. iPhone. That were great. <laughs> okay. Computer. Now I'll think of the absolute worst possible brand name for that product. Um. Yeah, I'm not good at this shit, bro. Yeah, Logan, you suck at this. Dude, I'm just here to laugh at you guys. The worst possible. Why are you answering, Gage? I did answer. What did you say? Oh, you said computer. Okay, makes more sense. Sorry. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I can't wait for this. <laughs> oh. Hmm. So brand name would be like, it's a, it's the company's name. No, I know. I know. I'm trying to come up with something. Okay, so it's the company's name. Mm -hmm. Correct. Come up with? Correct. So instead of an Apple iPhone, I would have blank iPhone. But it'd be... Very off putting. Off putting. <laughs> off putting. <laughs> oh, I, I no more pudding. <laughs> yeah, see, I don't know what to do. Hello, friends. Welcome <laughs> to Off Pudding, where we sour your cream. <laughs> yeah. Off pudding. Yeah, that is a real word. Okay, off pudding. I had to Google it. Make off sure. pudding is an actual word? Yeah. It says unpleasant. Oh, pudding. Unpleasant. Off pudding. It's very oh, no bueno. Probably not. Like Gage, you have anything? I'm still thinking. Um, yeah, just like that. <laughs> Internet box. Internet, Internet box. box. Uh huh. Fucking boring. That would, makes it the worst name. All right, Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a tough one. Next. Where was the most embarrassing, embarrassing place you farted? In class. Um, Bent uh, over. Job interview. No. <laughs> uh, why am I not surprised? Did you get the job? I definitely got the job. Did they hear you? I don't know, but it smelled Did like it... ketchup and onions. <laughs> <laughs> Logan. On an airplane, maybe? Mm. Eh, they ain't that bad. No, because no, see, the airplane, you can... There's fucking 70, 80 other people in there that you can blame it on. Nobody's going to think it's you. Unless they can hear you. Huh. What if you make it? <laughs> oh, the airflow in the air is bad too so what movie was that everybody starts puking on a plane no the poison gas oh Harold Harold Kumar. Kumar. <laughs> Kumar. Poison gas. oh they brought a bomb as a ball next Button. um come on I'm like, I'm if like, you I'm couldn't like... be convicted of any one type of crime, what criminal charge would you like to be immune to? So I can do it. I can you do get this. One, you get one free pass. It's a free you pass. Yeah. Oh, so you're saying free pass? Yes. That's what I just said. Literally. So whatever you want to do, what do you want to do? I want to be. But you'll never get in trouble for it. I want to. Pablo Escobar is my idol. I want to be a professional criminal. I think that would be it's awesome. one time. Yes, it's a one time deal. Oh, bestiality. <laughs> <laughs> Easy. <laughs> oh man, I I just I don't know. Hide your wife, hide your, your kids, and hide your pets <laughs> as well. We'll be right back. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I would probably say robbery. I was going. I was thinking bank robbery. Yeah. yeah. You guys are pieces of shit. We're the pieces of shit. You want to fuck your dog. We want money. You want to fuck he didn't a, say a dog. Fucking... He didn't say it was a house a dog. Pet. He's been looking. Every time he goes to your house, he's looking at kidding, looking dude. at Lily a little weird. Oh, that's weird. No, Lily's got when I woke up this teeth. morning, she was in bed with you. <laughs> so now I don't like talking to you. Put up teeth. She does. It's a weird thing. Like, like, when, like when I'm when I'm dating or anything, it's like if you got messed up teeth, I can't. I'm sorry, I can't do it. That's a pot. That's a topic in itself of no, what what's dogs. a turn off. <laughs> well, they're dating dogs, they need to have good teeth. What's a non-sexual turn on, turn off? That's a pocket. That's a topic in itself. That's a question what right now. Say? Are you okay? Yeah. 
He said, what's a non-sexual turnoff? Well, he just said teeth would be a big one. Yeah, teeth. 100%. I'm weird with teeth. And also shoes. I'm... <laughs> So they have bad shoes? Yes. I'm I'm no, like I'm, I'm super judgment I'm not a judgmental person at all. Sounds pretty fucking have, judgmental. No, time off. You have fucked up teeth, I can't do it. I like it just it's super I big turn off. That, you gotta say that the rest of your shoes, life. Shoes, it's like if if you're that, you're you talking like bad don't. shoes or like they wear outfits where the shoes don't match? No, well, I'm talking about bad shoes. shoes. Like if you had like you wear like the Walmart Sweet. No, I don't care what kind of shoes. Like you but do. if you're like if you're like wearing a dress or wearing something nice and you have like super, super fucked up shoes. So what I just okay, said. So, 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 <laughs> so what I just said. This is not a brain. You don't take care of your shoes. No, 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 no. That's not what I said. I said they're wearing shoes that don't match what they're wearing. No, 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 no. That doesn't matter. That's what you're saying. That's what you're saying. That's like weird off the wall shit. That's what you just said. the shit that I wear. if they're wearing super nice clothes and they got on shoes that are all dirty and stuff. No, that are all fucked up. Like that's that's shoes that don't match what they're wearing. Are you saying like they don't take care of their shoes? That's fair. I'm just saying like yeah, if you don't take care of your shoes, like I don't care what brand they are. If you don't take care of your shoes, like it's it's just kind of a turn off. Not necessarily. I wouldn't date them for that, but it would just it's kind of a turn off. I get it. It's kind of weird, like. The, the, first thing look, the first thing I look at is their shoes and their teeth. That's, saying, it. that's like, what I look at. First thing, they got a mask on. Will you please take care that's of why it sucks. Shoes. That's why I'm single. First thing, I don't want to. I don't want to take the chance that anyone I talk to has shitty teeth. So I'm not talking to anyone. She is a ten, but her shoes are just awful. Dude, it's you, you have know. to make Can a decision. Clean, I'll have to make that decision on the fly. And it probably that's depends how much clean like, you've had. Be like, I don't know. I'll probably lick her shoes before her mouth. Hell. Uh, our voice is a big one for me. Yes, voice is. Ooh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's been some that I'm fucking like, fucking shit, dude. Yes. Bro. Some people I'm just I like, don't ever fucking talk. I will mention off the air, but there's someone in this room that had an ex girlfriend that their voice was fucking horrible. And I'm so happy that they don't date that I anymore. I really want to stop recording right but, now just so I know who it is. <laughs> well, I'll tell you when we're off the air. Yeah, no names. But it's uh, that's a huge one, man. I hear if there's some voices that I just cringe and I'm like, what? Stop talking. Just stop talking. Um, horrible. Another thing is, you got like a bunch in the of summer, these. In, oh, it, why do you think he's single? Yeah, exactly. Um, in the summer, I'm not picky. I'm really not picky. But anyway, in the summer, like when everyone like sandal season, toes, and the one toe that's not the big toe is longer than the other toes. That's a normal thing. Lots of people have that. that. Mine is. Mine's like that. Yeah. Your, your your middle toe, toe is longer than your big toe. toe. That's Bull fucking Dude, shit. That's a genetic thing. There's a lot of people that do. You want me to take my sock off? Yes, take your sock off. Your middle toe is not longer than Mine your Mine is toe. not, but there's a, that's a normal thing, dude. No, it's not. Your middle toe? Oh, your middle, middle toe. toe. Oh, not the second toe. In. No, middle the middle toe. toe. Don't, Don't touch my feet again, by the way. I've never seen that before. It creeps me out, it's dude. I've seen that twice, them. and it's like, whoa. Oh, my... It's weird. Like, no. I mean, no judgment. I'm not a This is a huge judgment. judgment. Dude, you have said that seven times. I know. And it's nothing but I, I don't care. I don't care. I really don't. I don't care what you do. I don't care what it is. But some things just bother me. I don't care about things, but I care about these so a lot. I don't want you to talk to in your Tinder book profile. you got to have nice teeth. you got to have beats and shoes. Yeah, really, honestly, and the really only thing is, is the teeth thing. Because if, if you have, like, messed up teeth, it's like, it bothers me. What if, what if they, what if they're, it, what if they're it's someone that's like, like, oh my god, god, we hit it off, this they're is just great, weird off the wall this is a hypothetical time. situation here, they're great, everything's perfect, teeth are fucked up, but then all of a sudden they get them fixed. How fucked up are the teeth? Yeah, but I mean, if his thing is teeth, he's probably not going to get to that point where it's like, hitting it off. But how, 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 so what if they have fucked up teeth, but they got races on? Sitting next to us here, I mean, that's exactly what I feel like, because... You see somebody's teeth. You have a great personality. Everything's perfect, but their teeth are fucked up, and that's gonna that's gonna end it for my you. My thing is, my thing is, we're twenty seven years old, and I, I, I don't want to look at that for the rest of my life. For one, for two, it sounds fucking horrible. Shallow hell, yeah, absolutely. But I, I just think that if I don't know, I, I want to, I. I take pride in my smile a little sure. bit, and I I take care sure. of my teeth, and I want I want so that in my like, you, You're well. talking like fucked up, fucked up. Not no, like, I'm talking about snaggle like, 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 um, That's what I'm talking like, about. Uh, I don't care if it's like if you have like yellow Lily. teeth, I don't give a fuck. Like yeah, Lily's like teeth, yeah. yeah, like the dog's teeth. God oh, damn it! Um, but <laughs> Logan hasn't said anything yet. Dude, Dude, like teeth that are like just really crooked and stuff. It's like you know, I I can't do that. I'm I'm sorry. I just I can't. Before Logan goes, did you were you as picky and into into teeth before you dated Kayla because obviously she went into dental hygiene so that was big for her 
Did oh, that make yes. you more self-conscious no, about it, it? It probably enhanced it a little bit. Sure. But I definitely yeah. thought that prior. Logan? There's a... I don't know. I'm not good at these. Biggest turnoff huh. for you, what would it be? Mm. Being, like, way too done up. Like oh, makeup, too much makeup, too much makeup. Heavy, yeah. like whoa. I like natural. Yeah, natural is way too hard. Like if you don't look the same like in the morning as you do if I were like meet you at night when you're all done. Half up. their faces on the pillow when you wake up in the morning. Right. Like I don't, I don't like that. I don't know if like if you're just not cool with like what you look like. And yeah. I think you need to. Why do you think I would be cool with you if you're not cool with you? Right. Gage? And I want you to all smell right. good. Yeah, I, I mean, there's some pretty obvious shit. Like, you can't, right. don't smell like shit. Like, yeah, I'm not going to talk to you. But I'm pretty sure I already answered, Mike. I'm, okay. The front smells like that. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> That's disgusting. <laughs> but um, to get to that point, you would already have to have liked them. Or not liked them. But I'm just sure. That's what, yeah. That's what, what, what was your answer? I'm sorry if I missed it. You said you already went. What was it? I don't remember what you said, but it was whatever you said. You just can't agree with me. You got to come with something different. No, I, it's not a giraffe. A giraffe? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I know we're not going to bring up giraffes around Jordan. <laughs> Bestiality over here. God. That's what he wants to fuck, dude. That's what 100% what he wants to fuck. He's like, oh, it only happened one time? Bestiality. Sure. No, and the thing is with that is everybody's got, like, I will say this. I, everybody okay. in this room has like their own preference. Like you see something, I I will say smell is a big thing. And the only reason I say that is like cigarette smell is an instant. You're out. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah, I, I'm not a fan. I chew and I'm like, no, fuck you. <laughs> well, that'd be a turn off for me. Dude, yeah. Women that chew. Women that chew. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That happens. Like a huge double standard, I guess. Mm -hmm. Not that I chew, but like I don't care that you chew. But if you were a woman and you're chewing, I think it's gross that I chew. I hate that I chew, but. Yeah, and like now all of a sudden you're chewing long cut, which I'm. I was like, what the fuck? No, I chew. Chewing, I, chewing I chew more cut. now on on uh, day shift, but it's I. I'm I'm trying to figure out my routine and getting. I'm I'm gonna quit eventually. I'm gonna quit. I don't want to chew. What, sounds like what. I'm addicted. What I'm addicted said. to caffeine. I'm addicted. I would to love to hear a woman's perspective on this, just because obviously like about chewing. Oh, no, there's so no, many no, no, turnoffs no, 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 for not just about chewing. Um, like you say, oh, turnoffs on turn -offs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like what, what, what they what's feel. a turn off? What takes it to the next step for them? Because like I've had I've had some women that tell me in the past like how good like because my cologne and like how good I smell and I've had like literally ones she's like you uh, literally the smell can make a fucking five into an eight just because they just smell so good and you can tell like they care about their appearance and you know mm -hmm. their themselves in a in a what sense. Are you Blue polo. But I, my dad, weird. my dad used to, and I don't, I don't know. I just always have. What did you just say? He said, "What do you think he said?" He said, "I'm gonna spread on my wiener." <laughs> <laughs> it hasn't worked for me, so I don't. If I can make that a, from a five to an eight, man. <laughs> 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 Your body's just like cracking like crazy, dude. He's so oh, man. ninety years old. Can I get a top five? What is this week's top five, Jordan? This week's top five is top five favorite movie theater snacks. Start us off. All right. Uh, my number one pick is mini chewy sweet tarts. Oh, nice. Good one. Nice. Mine's gonna be popcorn. The OG. <laughs> I, I think that was that, ass. my favorite. One of my favorite foods in general. And I knew it wasn't getting to me. <laughs> um. I'm gonna go with uh, blue and red mixed slush. Mm, that's a good one. Yeah, fuck yeah. Go to movie theater with that one. Nope. Mine is gonna be um, a Coke slushy. And so, how how OG are we going? Is what what are you? It doesn't ever. fucking matter. You can be coffee, a then. coffee. That's what I get every single time. Yeah. Let us let 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 be let's let be let be let has Starbucks inside of it that you can get in the movie theater. This would be the same thing as you saying beer from fucking Fallen Tempers. Shh. Um, it can be like even at home, if you're watching the movie at home. Because oh, then absolutely you know, coffee. You know, because it not a lot of people go to the movies. I haven't been to the movies. Literally, be anything that you can find while you watch a movie. Like what? Like when yeah, you sit down anything. to watch a movie, what the fuck is your go-to? Right, I got you. There, I'm going. Coke slushy because I get it every time, and coffee because I get it every time. 
So no snacks. Okay. Which are both snacks. I'm going to I'm going to stick to like shit that I remember getting at the movies. Um Sour Patch watermelons. Ooh. Mm. Uh cookie dough bites. Yeah, that was on mine. Those are so good. The chocolate covered ones? Yeah, and then um you only get one pick. Well, I was just going to reiterate that <laughs> I like the ones that are frozen. They have them keep them in the freezer and they give them to you. So. Oh, they have frozen ones? You should really? ask for them. That's a game changer. All right. Um, my second and third pick. Dude, I think we figured out a snake draft. You don't have to look at me every time. No, I need to. It's not. <laughs> um, my second pick is going to be Raisinets. Yuck. And <laughs> You're done. You skipped your Raisinets. <laughs> <laughs> They look like little rabbit turds. Um, and we know how much you like bestiality. <laughs> fuck off. It's a joke. Um, or was it? It, it was. That is and, a terrible uh, second round pick. And uh, okay, raising that's number two. Number three, I don't ever drink pop. Ever. All I drink is water. And number two is going to be a fountain. Mm, yes. Three. Three. Sorry. Great. Number three is Love fountain, fountain Sprite. Sprite. When I'm watching Especially a movie on a fountain Sprite. Sprite. Yes. Yes. Good pick. Mike? Uh, my number three is going to be Sour Patch Kids. It's different than watermelon, so yes. Very different. Way different. Yes. I accept it. I don't like the watermelon, actually. So. Were you hoping that he would accept your answer? Or... Oh, like it really I, think better, he did. I think the better question would have been, do I care if he accepted my answer? <laughs> did you? Uh, I'm going to go with those little crunch bites. Like the crunch bar, but really? they're like the... Nobody likes those. It's like the last thing Dude, in Halloween you candy. Said People like those because they like raisin nets. And I like them. I don't them. know how raisin nets are still in business. I don't know how raisin nets are still in business. I just fuck them at people in the crowd. <laughs> oh, yeah, and I'd be the one to be like, oh shit. Gage. Cool. <laughs> Rabbit um, turd. I'm going to say nachos. Ooh. Nachos. Yes. And I really, really like Skittles. Good answer. Hey, man, Good answer. For a long time. Um, I'm gonna go to the the little like unwrapped butterfinger bites. Good answer. You can also get those frozen. Can you? Yeah. Um, usually get a pretzel, cheese. Oh, uh, cheese. Le- 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 says pretzel cheese? bites. No, I don't like. I was just yeah. about to. I mean, I don't. Good. I've actually never had beer cheese at a movie theater. It's always nacho cheese from the bag. Yeah. You're right. Bag we, uh, of cheese. We went to that Great American Cookie place, the one that has the pretzel bites, and they have like the cheese stuffed ones. Holy fuck, those things are good. The pretzel, actually, the pretzel bites at Lettuce Commons are very fucking good too. All right, uh, my number four, mm-hmm. four and five, would be Laffy Taffy. Always been a big fan of Life Taffy. Remember when you used to fucking break it over my head? Yeah, the little Every Life Taffy sticks. I'd smack them on your leg, yeah. Mm-hmm. No, it wasn't his leg. It was his head. Yeah, your head. Um, And number five is a beer. Because at Le- or at uh, Fallen Timbers, I still don't think it, I still don't think there's so. a bar and you can get a beer. But the only thing about that is, I have love-hate relationship with that, is I got to piss halfway through the movie. I hate yeah. getting drinks, really, because I have a baby bladder, and I always have to piss. Like, as soon as I drink, no matter if it's like, uh, like everybody says, crack the seal after you drink a beer. I crack the seal after I drink a pop, a water. doesn't matter what it is. I'm like, I gotta have a fucking piss. No. Uh, my last would be Mike and Ike's. I gauge his nipples. I knew somebody's gonna, and it, actually, I knew you were gonna say it. Because I wasn't gonna say it. I knew you were. <laughs> at the at the terrain park at the the ski resort we were at today Whatever. or yesterday, there was like boobs with like nipples hanging off of them, like features. You grind up them and Wait, like made out of boob. You grind on the boobs. <laughs> anyway, Jordan's what's your ha- fifth? Pick? Jordan's hammer just grinding on these fucking statues. Now he's he's pumping these snow, <laughs> he snow boob statues. That's why you like to go snowboarding so much. Um. I don't. Are they called goobers? Or are they like the little mm-hmm. chocolate colored mm-hmm. peanuts? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna go with goobers. Chocolate my, goopy goober. My last pick is gonna be runts. Ooh, that's a good Ooh, one. I haven't had one of those in forever. 
I like the banana one. Yep, the ones that nobody ever. See, I don't. I love I, the banana I, ones. No, too. no, no, no. Yeah. Those things fucking. Those are hard. Those yeah. eat. Those are bust the fuck yeah. out of your teeth. Yeah, yeah. yeah you guys remember those big ass jawbreakers you used to get? Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't have like, time for Solder Village. Solder Village, yeah, Village, yeah, Solder Village yes. the big things. And yeah. it took like Everyone three and a half them. months to eat it. Yep. Yeah. The yeah. We they were like covering baseballs. it up and putting we it in our backpack just... or something. Yeah. Did you guys make you uncomfortable that you sucked on balls when you were a kid? I didn't, we licked them. We didn't suck on them. That's better than doing it now, like you. Ooh. Um, I don't, Good answer. Don't, Good I never answer. Like job breakers. It's balls. like family feud in here. Literally, dude, that's just funny with fucking Steve Harvey. You know? boss. He's fun. Some <laughs> of the quite, like the answers they give, and he's just like, "What?" So I was watching one, and this lady, she gave the same answer four times in a row, and he would like let her re-answer, and she was just enunciating the yes. word differently. <laughs> so I, it's the it's the mommy one. Yeah, like, mommy was already picked. Mom was already like, yeah, and he, like, she was like, "What about like, mommy?" mommy? Like, he was like, mommy? And she just kept saying it differently, like, four different times. And he's like... And he would, like, walk away and come back. It was, like, no joke, like, 15 minutes. And yeah. he would come back. He's like, all right, we'll try this again. And they That's finally gave her the X. It's hilarious because he like, does not give a fuck. No. Uh -huh. He'll literally be like, you are dumb. And then, that was the dumbest thing I ever heard. Some of the, time, some of the times they're like, the, team, the rest of the team's like, That's a good answer. He's like, that is not a good answer. <laughs> right. <laughs> are we doing a... Uh, a uh, I don't want to mention. I don't mention. We can. I don't care. Does everybody have one? I can think. Uh, fruit snacks. Fruit snacks. Fruit snacks. Huh. Welch's fruit snacks. Love us. I just go based off what love us comments <laughs> goes. Because Welch's grape juice. That's all. I haven't had grape juice in probably <laughs> 10 years, dude. <laughs> you know what's really good is cranberry, cran grape juice. I do like that. Cranberry juice is good in general. I'm going to go sour punch straws. Ooh, yeah, dirty I, I was thinking those. You say what? Sour Punch Straws is a great answer. Fuck. What? Those, are, those are great. Oh. Um. Ooh, man, this is tough. Jordan, you can go. I just won't be able to take it's what you. Your turn. I we're gonna. <laughs> Jordan, won't, Jordan won't, won't go. He just figured out how a snake draft works. He can't do it. Yep. It's like I can't go. It's official. I've already been. I know what the rules are. Um, fuck. I mean, I feel like all the big ones I usually take have already taken. You even. <laughs> <laughs> I have no it's idea what happened. I just said. I have no idea what I just said. I mean, I've taken like. Oh! Goldie's taken a lot of big ones. What is you what's do your, with me today? What's your honorable what mention? What is. What you, you've been mention. on me all day. What? I have not. <laughs> Lord, you. <laughs> What's your honorable mention? Plug your holes. Twizzlers. Ooh, good one. Fuck you, Jordan. You like, him. That you was like the annoying. normal ones or the peel ones? Either or. I like the peel I'm ones, normal. but I don't peel them. I just eat them. <laughs> <laughs> so you just like any Twizzler. <laughs> no, but they taste better. They do taste better. Remember those red vines that used to come That's what I'm thinking. My mom still so gets red those. Vines. I remember going to BG. Nobody cares. And... Going to that candy shop. <laughs> That's why the candy <laughs> shop went out of business. The, 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 the fucking movie theater is like, fuck you, because all your people go there and then they <laughs> right. fucking sneak the candy in. So I'd go get a bunch of fucking that bulk candy and uh, yeah, take yeah. it in. Yeah, I saw a picture. Dude, he's wearing a beanie. It's like sticking up his tall. He's like, be, like for real, if you worked in a movie theater, you're going to assume that I have a bag of Cool Ranch Doritos in my head. <laughs> <laughs> Do you never picture this? Um... My honorable mention would have to be. I'm not a fan of chocolate. I don't really care for chocolate. I like you're gonna, pay, you're gonna pick some chocolate. chocolate, but no, I'm not gonna. I'm what not gonna pick some chocolate. I you like chocolates. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck is that? Ticket. It's off um, SpongeBob. It is off SpongeBob. <laughs> it's a little fucking like prune lady. Yes, in the wheelchair. <laughs> what did you say? Let's go ahead and walk upstairs. <laughs> what did you just say? Is your honorable mention? That's insulting to disabled people. Will you fucking pick something? It's not chocolate. We know that. So what is it? He's, no, he's going to say it's not chocolate. Then he's going to pick some chocolate. He's going to be like Hershey's Kisses. No, I don't like Hershey's Kisses. Um, I will go with Gobstoppers. 
Didn't you just tell um, us you didn't like Jawbreakers? Isn't that basically yeah, that's what, what God it Sapper is? is. It's it's God Sapper is a Jaw. No, but I, I do agree. I would have, I would choose that over the big thing you got to lick for yeah, fun. Yeah, he just said he doesn't weeks. like Jawbreakers. Yeah. yeah, I'm pretty sure God Sapper says Jawbreaker. No, you know he what? doesn't like them because he doesn't want to lick them for five weeks. You know what? I just had the other day for the first time in like since Golden Graphics days. Ooh, sunflower are, seeds. No, I don't remember. Which would kind you of eat sunflower seeds in the movies? Forty ounces in a pack of sunflower seeds. Gum. Yeah, I just had gum the other day for the first time. So Low pop. Uh, no, big League Chew? Chico Sticks. Oh, oh my God. Dude, I forgot how fucking yeah, good they are. You used to eat Chico those Stick Captain. Yeah. Chico, Chico, Chico Stick Captain. <laughs> Chico Captain. Head of the Chico Stick team. I remember going to graphics. I'd always roll up like, in Two the morning. That or I'd have a fucking, for whatever reason, I'd have a Pepsi and a fucking bag of Funyuns. Dude, you used to be like, fucking like, weird like that. Before games. Like, yeah. I don't even like Pepsi anymore, but... Funyuns, you used to eat Funyuns every day, dude. dude. You used to eat Funyuns. Funyuns. There's another good top five favorite chips. It is, uh, yeah, would be a good one. I'm like, but I, I have a bad habit with. Next week, episode ten. Oh, blue label. Live. Pop, 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 pop open a blue label. Uh, Ohio. Johnny Walker blue label. That is engraved with the SOS podcast on the side. It's an official celebration of our 10th episode. Live from General Ohio. It'll be, it'll be, uh, it'll be live, live on Twitch Ohio. as well. Mm-hmm. This is, uh, Logan's already fucking sweating his ass off thinking about it being live. P.S. Follow us on social media. Or What's not. yours? I mean, it's, this is posted on all my social media. So, all right, so if, they, yeah, if they found it, they already follow Gage. <laughs> all right, well, follow me too. Jetty Adventure. Jetty Adventure. Jetty Adventure. Do you want to plug yourself here? Is that what you're doing? No, I'm not plugging use that myself. I bet you won't use that um, bottle. I'm not gonna what? sit on a bottle. Uh, <laughs> All right. <laughs> what the hell's happening? 